What's up is now, what's left is right. Chasing stars and holding me. I can't see the end, but we'll see it through. Come on, you win a coconut if you get these on. currently under the bed fitting the expansion tank um, which is for the hot water so water comes out of there oh can't see it out of there sorry from the chlorifier um, and then I'm going to connect the hot water tank there the expansion tank there so that's my job for now right so there's no point putting it on the wrong side to this one is the hot water side so I need to connect a t-junction uh, t-junction oh, that's an elbow i'm going to connect uh, t-junction uh, under the bottom of the uh, tank and then i'm going to cut the pipe but there'll be water in it and then i'm going to have to Circle that up to make sure there's not too much there. So my job is to put this underneath. It's a bit of a pain to get to. Uh, as well as cracked, so let's put a little water down there. Just disconnect that to make it a bit easier to move this point. Right, so that's all connected. Cut that end, so I'll just put a. I'll do the other one um, a little bit later. Still on at the moment. It's a lot of water, isn't it? 
Do we have enough water in our water tank for this? Yeah, we should do. That's the first look at our new boat. So just a little update on how we're doing at the moment and what the next steps are. We, as you might have seen in a few videos before, we cut out the um, hole in our worktop for the sink. So we decided to go for solid oak worktops, which are 40 mil thick. I'm pretty sure that's right. Um, they're really really thick and it was really hard work trying to do it um, and then this week we actually did try and cut out the hole for the hob I mean it was so challenging we didn't even film it <laughs> um, we just had to try and be focused and do it ourselves and try not to think about it um, it didn't work so we have got to the point now where basically we went to cut out the square for our um square hob and the plan was to have like obviously the edging of the oak around it but on the far side the edging was only going to be i don't i can't tell you the measurement but really really thin only like that um which was just generally poor judgment on our end. So as we were cutting it, cutting the hole out, that little bit, that little strip of wood snapped off. So yeah, that ruined that basically. <laughs> so um, we, I'm hoping that we haven't ruined the oak worktop and hopefully we've got enough of the worktop to use um going forward but we are gonna call we've decided to call in reinforcements and we're gonna get our amazing carpenters back so these are the guys that if you remember built our bed frame and built the wardrobe built the walls and um built the doors and put them in they did an amazing job and i think they're going to be able to do a better job at cutting out worktops than we are <laughs> so they're gonna come and they're gonna cut out a square for our hob to go into another thing that they're going to do is they're actually going to put um, a little shelving unit in the bathroom so just as you come in and you're looking at the shower just next to it there's going to be a load of shelves there which are going to store our things like our towels our bed sheets um, and then all of our refillable laundry detergent shampoo and all of those all of that stuff is all going to go um, in there. So they're coming soon and then hopefully next week you'll be able to see the process and see what they've done. So yeah, thanks for watching and see you next week. <laughs>